Hello everybody, welcome to the Season 48 CCL Champions Cup Playoffs Final between Ploppen and Diamond. In the booth with me is Fimea, Purple Chest and Dimmy G. Hello. Hello everybody, let me put some words before the PC starts talking and never stops. Here we are for the final rat with uh, two natties and some other pieces and a very, versus, a very good uh, find out more about these boobies. A necro team, which will need to kill every single rat. Well, he's done all right so far. He's got a KO on his first hit. <laughs> Hello, everybody. It's DBG. And uh, yes, we are going to see two exciting turns of Blood Bowl. It will either be the necro smashing the rats out of the game in two turns, or it will be turn eight and turn 16 when the rats win the game. <laughs> <laughs> Hello everybody, I think it's interesting the rats have already set up a little further back than you might expect. Uh, how much they're planning to actually challenge this Necro team and how much they are going to rely on their one turn ability. That's what we're interested to see. Hmm. Yes. Listen, Ploppen has a wizard and a babe and an extra apple. Yeah, lots, so lots of killing, killing the one turners is going to be particularly difficult. Well, it's down to nine rats already. Yeah, nice LOS. And he's got this diving tackle guy who's been incredible for him, actually, hasn't he, this tournament? The diving tackle has been very impactful. I think we're going to see a dirty player foul here as well. And be surprised. He's got to be... The one thing he's got to be careful of is Ploppen is going to come for him. If he doesn't if he doesn't run some guys back, Ploppen is going to come for him. So that, that I want the shrimp for and the diving tackle to come back. Yes, he might, he might be better off not blitzing this turn. I remember a yeah, game where yeah. PC played one time. Um, I don't know if he remembers it, where he, he was in this similar kind of situation. He went forward, he blitzed, and I thought that was a fundamental mistake, and he ended up did getting punished. I don't know if he remembers that, but uh, it yeah, was interesting. Yeah, absolutely. It's, well, I mean, there's been two or three of those in the chalice where I've, particularly on turn one, shouldn't have bothered blitzing, should have just defended my position, and instead have tried to get that edge, and it's cost me dear. Here we go, Diamond has elected to blitz. And yeah, that's a that's a fleshy going forward instead of back, isn't it? Which is... Mm. Not that bad it, it because at least can, he can be. protect a little... I mean, like, uh, the Poppen, he just he literally goes forward, and if it doesn't work, he lies down and waits. Like, that's the thing, isn't it? He's got nothing to lose by going forward and separating the team. Hmm. Oh, yeah, exactly. Yeah, he can just he can just bail on the drive any any time he wants. Ah, oh, so that gets that, the oh that my gets god, the okay, he's I going like in. <laughs> he's going in. And in today's episode of All the Eggs in the Same Basket, we have uh, Diomets. <laughs> yeah, I mean, but it can pay off, right? It can pay off. So this is this is the thing, isn't it? It's whether you go for the more cautious route or if you go for the. Ball he did the wall, this against going. Nolly, didn't he? he? Did this against Nolly? He went like, "Screw your Daka. <laughs> I'm <laughs> just gonna." That that shrimp ball really needs to come back. Yeah, you think he needs a bit back? But he's really going for it. I mean, the the fleshies are great, aren't they? With they stand firm and the guard, and then protecting the diamond tackle. So you know that he's stopping two gutters dodging here, isn't he? Basically, it's it's pretty strong. Obviously, if they do make the dodges, it's pretty terrible. <laughs> now, no, no, now, now it's uh, much better with a the zombie there, you know, uh, avoiding the chance of getting a free hit on the... Yeah, I don't know about this. Hit. This is rowdy. It's really rowdy. You could even come round the back with a with a ghoul. That's like that's the strongest, right? To come yeah. round the back with a ghoul. But then obviously he's completely exposed, so it's... This is very high risk, high reward. But will will Plopper know how to deal with it? Is the question. I think he has to go back. I think he has to come back with him because of the whiz, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because the armor break is just too strong. Yeah. yeah. Hello, Sandage, and any anybody else uh, who have missed? Hello, everybody. <laughs> uh, we got Jack Ball, Kalon, Flux, Streamer, Pedro, and Zaz. The Diego Maradona of Blopo. <laughs> Why? Have you, have you not seen him stream, Jim? <laughs> he literally looks like Diego Maradona. All oh, right. 
that's, that's like, another they're compliment. They're definitely related somewhere. That's they're like third compliment. generation, fourth generation <laughs> cousins. <laughs> I, want, I wondered if like Chugs was the heir. Uh... No, no, <laughs> Chugs is like the Maradona of Blood Bowl, but just without the talent. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, the rat has downless. Uh, oh, but he just gets pushes. That, uh, I don't know. You like the, uh, uh, the castle. Full of it, maybe a re-roll because it's a really <laughs> strong uh, hit. He managed to get it. because well, he's, he's got to hit this stand firmer with tackle. Might blow. Mm. Surely. That's that's Jeremy Beadle, Kaelon. Oh, is, is he just going to do all the dots? Oh, he's running away. Uh, mm. I don't think that's far enough. Mate, <laughs> the, the rackle, the rackle ship ball is the one that needs to make the dodge off the diamond tackle. Oh, he's one ding him, gets the push. Yeah, but that's the one that matters, right? Oh, yeah, right now I can dodge him because it's a bit. Yeah, not in dodge ball. Yeah. Yeah. was a uh, two plus because he has wrestle, so you know. Uh, and now the one turner is run free away to as run well. away. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck off, at least, at least I guess he's got him on the back foot, right? Whereas, I, uh, so this is actually pretty good, right? He's, he, he I went think, no, 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 he runs forward. He runs forward yeah. with both of these. Ah, oh, don't take the hit. Dodge and go through. Uh, I think he dodges both gutter runners and runs, and then and then he has to blitz one of them. And if, if, if both of them are in range with the lightning bolt, then we see that, and if not, then we don't. Mm. Just with the, I think, this guy back, you know, I think if you... Yeah, I think it's a missed opportunity from Plopham. Maybe, yeah, I mean, it, yeah, because he put everything into this, didn't he? Everything forward, it was yeah. very high yeah. risk, he could have been punished. Like, put the lightning bolt, like, because he's not going to hand off, like, he's not going to do any any of that nonsense. The, that strip ball rackle needs to be deep in the uh, necro half, I think. And the yeah, other... I, I, I agree with Timmy. Push even one gutter into the back of the with how far the Diabet's pushed forwards. I think he'd have to look to hand off to the strength four, which I don't think he wants to do. Exactly, yeah. It's a one in nine um, to lose the game, yeah. yeah whereas now he's... Now he's just going to get banged on. I think Diomed absolutely intimidated the uh, Ploppen there. Yeah. I think Diomed's style completely threw Ploppen, yeah. Yes. I think Ploppen wasn't expecting, you know, the situation and they preferred to, you know, think about saving his pieces than actually going uh, for it. And if 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 Diomed does not tackle Pom, the Rackle strip baller this turn, then I will never speak to Diomed ever again. <laughs> <laughs> Gets three dice on him as well, doesn't he? I know, like, and if that is not the Blitz, then what the hell are we doing here, ladies and gentlemen? Well, he, he, <laughs> could, he could, he could, he could GFI Blitz the... Um, no, uh, mate, one, it's the no, Rackle I, ship ball. Yeah, I think I agree. All day, every day. I agree. What he can even do is he can even put people around the back, but no, he can't, I don't know, because he doesn't get the movement. No, if he, if he could get people around the back, he could even chain the uh, Storm Vermin for a, a fleshy hit. If that is not the Blitz, then I have no idea what I'm doing here. Maybe I should uh, quit Blood Bowl. Maybe <laughs> he goes for the Tackle Pommer, actually, like... Just purely because that's the biggest threat to his players. Yeah, maybe. Well, I, I, I still like. See, the thing, the thing is with these rats is like, um, the two gutters being so deep is Dima doesn't care now. Like he can, he can take a free pom anywhere. Yeah. Like whereas if both of those rats are in range of the ball and the wizard and the score, then, then it completely changes this turn. This is far too comfortable for Dima. Yeah, yeah. He went, he went high risk, and then. Ploppen didn't even put in a mild threat, did he? So like, yeah. Oh, no, no, you fucked that turn completely. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. I mean, the biggest problem that Diomed faces right now is which of the high-value targets he wants to hit. <laughs> yeah. It's got to be the strip ball rackle, mate. It's got to be. It's going to be. It has to be. Like, and then there's the foul as well. So he's got the pom and the foul, and both of those gut runners. He's uh, guaranteeing the three dice because he's going to move the Russell Dirty player uh, to the top corner, then blitz from the bottom corner. So he can, you know, if he gets a push, can push into the fleshy. 
Yeah. Or even come down, right? He could even come down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. He could come down as well. I think Popper needed to have both cutters. He can do it anyway, in, can't he? In DMS half that time. Yeah, but I mean, the way I'm saying, looking at it is the three dice. Well, you know, getting yeah. six dice without uh, any risk. But the thing seems going up. Yeah. Oh, God, yep, he's oh going for the edge five. The edge five is the, is the wizard threat, right? That's the thing. That's This is the thing, Jimmy. Like, this is what I thought he might go for him because I know he wanted to go for the strip baller, but he's got sure hands on the carrier. And the edge five big hand is the uh, is the wizard threat, right? But the the edge five big hand isn't anywhere near the ball, which was not my... this turn. Yeah, not this yeah. turn. But like that's how he wins, isn't it? He bolts, he dodges through with edge five, picks it up with big hand, sure hand, and fuck, and you know, and fucks off. So yeah, I guess, I guess. Yeah, I'd have been looking either the biggest killer or the biggest threat. So as Jimmy says, I think the agility five big hand is is with a the wizard. Problem, it's just uh, the so thing strong. Is the the thing is, is if he goes for the Rackle strip ball and he doesn't, and he poms and he doesn't break arm, he can foul it with dirty player afterwards. Yeah. Whereas he can't foul the edgy five with a dirty player afterwards. Yep. Yeah. I just didn't think it was worth saying I would never speak to him again, Jimmy. <laughs> I'm, I'm never speaking to him, Ed. I'm never speaking to him, Ed. You have to fulfill your words, again. you know? A man is a slave to his word and a master of his silence. <laughs> I will never speak to him again. That's it. We're done. <laughs> no, this is a really good uh, situation for the because the rats right now are like... They're only two rats down and they feel like they don't have no players at all. I think he needs to just base the wolf with the AG5 and then try and dodge out and claw from it. Yeah, he's going to oh, blitz no, this. Yeah, yeah. He's going to blitz this because it's a diamond tackle. He has to, he has to protect the, the natty. And, and can he get a foul on that werewolf as well? <laughs> like, can you imagine if he gets a double whammy, two werewolves removed? Oh, baby. Oh, my God, he gets one removed! Yeah, yeah, and then now he's got a foul on that other werewolf. Oh, oh he hasn't regened either. Oh, God. Oh, oh that's quite oh, bad. God. Yeah. That's brutal. That's absolutely brutal. And he's got a 3 plus 2 assist foul on this niggled AV bust werewolf. Yeah. Yeah. yeah maybe you do. I mean, yes, that's right. That's why. That's, I mean, I didn't mind what Dimmy was saying about take out their biggest killer first. Yeah. Yep. Because then you can yeah. pile on a lot safer. Then, and also it keeps you there's more. There's no as a reason. Pack. Yeah. There's no yeah. reason for that wolf to base that gutter runner because yeah. it's doing nothing. When it was in his half, it's doing something. Yep. Yeah. Oh my god! And he snakes. Yeah. Sure feet. Yeah. Yeah. What's he called? Ploppin acts, acts like sure feet never fails, doesn't he? I've noticed he does a lot of GFIs. Are basically irrelevant <laughs> with it. I mean, that, that is a massive cas for Ploppen, and it probably makes this final a game, right? Cause... Mm, well, it makes it less of a game, I think. I think the diamond tackle is what was making it a game, and I think that makes it less of a game. I don't know. I, I mean, I thought from the start that uh, he should have fouled that Pommer, but then he would have snaked I think DMA's the slightly better coach. I think Ploppen is, is a, as, as good a bet for this as DMA is. Nah, like, when you say slightly better coach, no disrespect to Ploppen, but they are worlds apart. It's like me playing PC, like, PC's just not on my level. <laughs> Banner! <laughs> I think I'm okay, definitely, definitely not think... on your level, Dimmy. I, that I would agree with you. <laughs> <laughs> Dimmy. I think now they play is, uh, Blitz the Wrestle Tackle, and then foul the AG5. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Whereas, like, he, I think he should have fouled the werewolf, but, like, obviously he would have snaked the dodge out to foul him. I would have fouled him with a kick piece. There you go. You can speak to Doom Ed again now. Yeah, I don't know, mate. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> from... I'm disappointed from last turn. Last turn was horrendous. <laughs> there we go. Get some this time. I know they're all still fails, but I would still rather fail doing something that is probably the right thing. Fail doing something that probably isn't. Yes. Whoa! Well, that's oh, a big cast cool. back! Is, is it going to be one of the apples? It has to be an has apple. Apple yeah. fail? Yeah. Apple fail. Extra oh, lino. Yeah, this double is six. over. This is that over. This is the regen fail. 
Is this over? It's not over. It's not over. Still there's the wizard. It still feels there. over. If, that that DP if, is in if, range to foul. Oh yes, if he fouls now the IG5, yeah, which, this is the big yeah. one. He should do it. <laughs> yeah, this is a big this, one. This feels over, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Don't say it's over! <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Well, there were two possible uh, results for this. You know, Diomed gets the enough cast potential to, you know, actually get the the upper hand, or Ploppen just use the Natis. Yeah, and they can have both. Like, both can happen. D Diomed can absolutely bang out Ploppen to death, and he can have, like, three three rats left, and as long as two of them are good, yeah, he yeah. only needs he only needs two rats because he has two natty. So one to pick up the ball, and yeah. another one to run away. Yeah. yeah. Oh well, that's a big one. When you say big one, do you mean massive, Jim? <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't say massive, but I'd say that's big. I mean, that's big, isn't it? It's not massive. Ma massive is a gutter or the other or the other killer, isn't it? But this is this is big. That's still big losing him. He needs to foul. He needs to foul that AG5. He has to foul. He has to foul. And if Come he gets, on. if he gets the AG5, I think it's GG. Yeah, because he's he's got enough to protect the ball. Like there's not there's no Here we go, ball, lads. so he has to he has to foul. Yes. Hundred percent. The only question base. is, does he get the extra assist in from the white? Probably. Yeah, he does. Yeah, yeah. Hundred percent, mate. Hundred percent. This is base this is the other the one turner with the fend zombie before doing the foul. This is DMA <laughs> cozing, cozing, coasting to a win. Rats have, rats have two babes, two babes, and only one apple left. And maybe lizard. he should have took two apples. Yeah, maybe, maybe he should have done. But I don't know. He's got three players KO'd, so the the two babes are pretty looking pretty good. Yeah, well. but they're shit players. Do you know what I mean? Like you yeah. wanna you wanna apo the good players. But like... he, he does need numbers so that he doesn't have to put the uh, he doesn't have to put the natty on the LOS, right? If he has to put the natty on the LOS, then he can have two stand firm there. And two stand firm there. It's like he, he doesn't need more than three players, really. He needs probably five players to one turn. If this is the case, this is GG. Oof. Okay. Not this turn, not this turn, but uh, the rat is going to eat the boot again. He's going to eat the boot every turn for the rest of the game. <laughs> yes, Chigan, yes. The, the apple hasn't done anything anyway. He could just bolt here, right? And he's got the dodge away. Uh, and. Hunt, and yeah, then yeah, pick pass up, it to yeah, this pick guy. Up, yeah, pick up the natty, run him into rain. Well, run him one square forwards. <laughs> <laughs> and then, well, you have to bolt first, don't you? Know, yeah, bolt, mm -hmm. and then, and then worst case scenario. Oh no, worst case scenario, it's a five plus pickup because the top left scatters. Yeah. The the anti quatrex is the worst <laughs> scatter there. Yes. Uh, whereas you are ideally looking for the quatrex scatter. Yeah. Followed by the pick up and throw. Yeah. Yeah, that's very true. <laughs> uh, and for anyone that doesn't know what the Quatrex is, it's the bottom right diagonal. <laughs> because it's easier to say. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, Jim. Jim highlighted it there for a brief second. Yeah, actually, no, that's 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 a shit scout. No, no, he's moved, got four. One, two, three, four. The, the, this one, top, top, top. Top tracks. He only needs. He only needs the. Um, uh, oh no, he's not Either these three are good, but this is the closest. He's not, he's not wizarded. I tell you what, I would have fancied that wizard. I think Jim. Yeah. It's not Dior jargon. No, it's just it's just Dimmy jargon. Pretty funny. Yeah. <laughs> we created the quatrix, which is the bottom right diagonal. <laughs> and you know, good. Oh, that's fucking horrendous. I think the wizard there into pick up and inaccurate is fine. Yeah, it was it really wasn't bad, was it? Like, you know, if you Yeah. It really wasn't bad. And then just one turn on like your turn nine. Mm. Um and then it's two two and then he has to score twice or have a fifty fifty to lose the game. Mm. It's a few dice though, right? So it would it would have been like a. F it, the, the worst case scenario is it scatters between the ghoul and yeah. the zombie. And, and any and of these five scatters were pretty shit, to be honest. 
No, like, no, 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 no. Yeah, they would. Like, you've got to, you've got to dodge away. You've got to pick up an attack zone with Edge three. Like it was, it was all pretty shitty. Like, but I think he's he's at that point where he's got to do something that isn't that good because he's in a he's in a bit of a pickle. So I think it was one of those where it's not that good, but it's probably the best you're going to get. If he does on one turn, this is this is it. This is this pretty is much. Yeah, it's, it's looking bad for him. He doesn't get the one turn. Yeah. He's missing his rec wrestle strip on. <clears throat> he had an opportunity, Tom. He had an opportunity to throw caution to the wind and throw the gutter runners up and go. Look, you're gonna blitz one of them. I like, have one of them, but you can't blitz the other one. And then I can bolt your ball. And yeah, I, think, I think he had to try to. He could have stalled it. He could have stalled it because uh, Dima didn't have anything in his backfield. Yeah. Like, so, once you, like, if, and especially with the armor break, like, he could have stalled it for, like, two turns. Yeah, I think, I think he, uh, he, like, he probably should have tried to punish him, like, you know, like, D.O.X. Dioff, Diomed, exposed himself to, like, that, didn't he? And he didn't even try to exploit it, and I think he should have tried, even if he tried and failed, I think he should have at least tried to. It's better to give up the drive in your opponent's half than give it up in your own half, or you're going to get fouled every turn. Especially without an Apo, and he went double babes and not an Apo, which I I question. Get someone near the ball, man. Thing is, is he has to break armor on this AV5. Yeah, he has to. Yeah. Otherwise, the bolt and the AV5, uh, AV5, AG5, just jumps up, walks out, picks it up, and lobs it. And yeah. Then you've still, yeah, and then you've lost. Right. Yeah, and if he if he moves him over, then he's not protecting the ball, so he's he's yeah. got yeah, he's got to come back to protect. So the claw upon yeah. if he doesn't break not armor on this him. this gut runner, he probably still loses. Like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a huge foul. Yeah, this is GG if this uh, if this foul fails almost. I wonder if you GFI with the the ghoul, right? Uh, move move the fleshy, and then GFI with this ghoul from the resist. It's probably worth the extra assist, honestly. Yeah, I think it is worth a GFI for the extra assist. He's got the reroll, so it's yeah, it's a one in thirty-six, isn't it? It's not the end of the world. Yeah, I think it was worth it because he has he has to break AV. He does. But he gets sent off, and uh, what no, we aren't still to see the impact of those babes, Timmy. I mean, these KOs, like the rats, always take a lot of KOs. They are all coming back, so. Oh, they... the, the, the babes mm -hmm. are a good option because they they allow you to keep you know meat on the pitch. Yeah. Yeah. yeah ideally, it's more about your star player, isn't it? Yeah. Like okay, you you, you don't you start, you want to use an app on your star player, but, but what's better is your star player not getting hit, isn't it? And yeah, and having having oh. line rats to take those hits. Also, is... your star player could also get killed, you know, and you know you are gonna have him back. Mm. Really sure. So it's. All right, you you are forcing you know the to be must be a cast yeah. to achieve anything. Now next turn, next turn he can make this a bigger foul. Like, he's got to keep fouling him because like it's just stupid because he can just he can just bolt and win, can't he? <laughs> oh god, that's such a ridiculous play with the whiz. I could, I could meet you, but I guess you could just meet you, but right. Three, so yeah, he's got nine. He can he can full meet cube. He doesn't have to foul at this turn. But obviously, fouling it is you fun as well. Meet cube versus a fireball, mate. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, shit. Yeah, you can meet yeah, cube. Yeah. Although that's only fifty percent of knocking the ball down, but still. Yeah. I mean, his other option, there just aren't enough rats. He can swap to the other side of the perch and just have a line of three between the gutter runner and where the ball is. I mean, it, it takes you towards the tackle, Palmer, but still. I think he's. I think he's got a pretty much steer where he is. Double GFI foul, hasn't he? It's about what he's committed to, I guess. He has. I mean, uh, 
that target is too easy to not keep following it. Mm, it's, it's it's too it's too dangerous. It's lethal, isn't it? Like he just has yeah, to. Yeah, he has to. He has to foul him. Like he mm. can't not foul him. Yeah. And if you if you get a send off with no stun, like you're screwed. Mm. Yeah, exactly. I mean, he, he gets another double. Okay, that's the game. You know, that's the rules of the game. But it's not the wrong move at all. Mm. The right move is put the boot there every single time. <laughs> Maybe. The line, the zombie to here, the cool forward one, he goes in for another assist and then double GFI foul. The wolf trying to get the natty. <laughs> yeah, he needs, the it, hand, he needs it. The hand begins. <laughs> how, how do you do that though? How do you do that? He, he's a gutter runner, he's movement nine. You want to double GFI? It kills, it kills the bolt because he could bolt and then... Ah, yeah, he put him in his more assist. Yeah, he's got to break AV, so yeah, that makes sense. Uh, he's, he's gonna. This is going to be a flesh column foul. <laughs> it might be a single GFI, non-DP foul. Yeah, I think so, yeah. That's the safest one. Safe. Uh, I think the Omed is gonna at least try to do the. The fact that this game isn't over yet already is ridiculous, <laughs> and it's only because of an insane rat team. If he now hits it with a DP, it's an auto break, isn't it? It's double GFI. Yeah, yeah. But it is he can make GFI. he can make one GFI, see what happens, you know, and then make the other one. Yeah, <laughs> make the other one whatever happens, yeah. This is a uh, Still gotta make it, haven't you? That's what re-rolls are for. Yeah, you have to re-roll that. One million. Yeah, of course. One what what else are you gonna re-roll? Okay, go, KO is perfect for uh, Ploppen. Good news for Ploppen. That KO is good for him, yes. There's no way you fireball this, you just try and get the gutter runner. Well, you can't get the gutter runner away from the Pommer, which is terrifying. Uh, yep, he's fucked. You can, <laughs> gutter is fucked you can expose your Claw Pommer to expose him, but you've got two 90s anyway, so it's not that bad. But, oh, he's, yeah, he comes back, okay, well, yeah. That means you can always pop him into the absolute corner, can't you? Which means he gets surfed instead of. Yes. Um, yeah. yeah. PC yeah. with the genius strats. <laughs> but you got to protect from Pom. <laughs> yeah, he could. He could bought the. He could bought the wolf here. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah, good. That's, that's good. That's a good idea. I like that. Stand in the corner and get surfed instead of Pom. Yeah. Getting auto. -in. Like how stupid is Claw Pom that you would rather just get auto injured. <laughs> Is that better to get auto injured? I, I don't know. I was partly taking the piss, but it's an idea, isn't it? It is an idea. I don't know if it's good or not. Like that, it's bad that we don't know if it's good or not. <laughs> I think yes. At this point, you know, someone should have made a match. Yeah. What are the chances yeah. of getting? Uh, I think well, uh, you take the risk of the armor break, but he's staying right there. I think it's probably better just to risk the hit. If, uh, certainly if they're not prepared to put a re-roll in. The problem is Diamid will put a re-roll in to get the Oh, the one dice. million percent. Yeah, and, he's it is only, percent. and he's got frenzy. Yeah, so yeah it is only two dice, so he's looking at at least six hits here. Yeah. But he can't get the three die. If it was the three die, then it might be better to yeah. take the serve. Is it Corn Knight? Oh, good. Well, I'm glad it's at least close, my ridiculous idea. But yes, I don't think I would have done it. Oh, so two pushes. Oh, there we go. Boom. There is no other Apo. Yeah, yeah, there is. Yeah, there is. Yeah, that's oh, it. He has two yeah, there Apos. Uh, yeah, the, yeah, yeah, you got oh, the hell are you talking about? He has two. He used yeah. one with the dead. It was two and two instead of three Apos, which I thought was the right pack, the right choice. Yeah, maybe, actually. 
In a one-off game, yeah, absolutely, I think so. Yeah. yeah, there's a lot of kills. He's getting a lot of value, and he was always going to get a lot of value from the from the babe and, and the, the apple. Babe, yeah. To be fair, like he couldn't go wrong. Do you know what I mean? He was going. Right. He was. He'd really want five apples and and two babes, wouldn't he? You know, like at the end of the day, he was always going to get value, whatever whatever he took. Well, he's guaranteed two natties. He needs he needs the edgy five back to hand off to one of the natties. Yeah, yeah, sure. Hands it important, isn't it? Like getting those skill rolls is like yeah. it's pretty important. He needs, if, if he doesn't get that one back, then he's down to one natty, and a perfect defense can just absolutely screw him. Well, but now he has the two natties. Yeah, he's got both natties, but he's got no one to get the ball to the natty. Is the problem? Right? I mean, well, what other natties can get into the other? Natties can give to the natty. Yeah, but then, but then the perfect defense and the blitz are yes. much more terrifying. Right? Yeah, but you know, so is a meteor strike hitting and killing all of us. Sometimes you can only plan on the things you can plan on. Pop. Did he score? I'm surprised that for Dimi having two nuts is not enough. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, you need at least three. <laughs> oh, 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 oh! All the chaos. Yeah, um, all the chaos. See, that happens to me without any babes. So I guess it's kind of reassuring that with babes it still happens too. <laughs> hey, look at those sixes. Jim, check the dice rolls. I want to see. Oh, yeah. The babes. They, oh, the babes did one. The one babe. babe. The babe got one back. <laughs> <laughs> Three sixes. This is very sunny. So is a... Uh... Apo confirmed correct. Three Apos confirmed correct. Yeah, and now maybe. he has got two natties, and now he can blitz through the back line as well, because he's got a guard natty. So he can hand <laughs> off, put the guard natty in, blitz through the back line on the 2D, so and like stupid. not e not even have to fucking dodge. It's just so disgusting. I'm so dumb. And he's got juggernaut as. No, he hasn't got juggernaut. No, so. he hasn't. No. Downless. Otherwise, he could have got a push. I, I guess the Dauntless is fine. I, I guess we can hit the Flesh Golem and try and pom it first. Yeah. Yeah, it's basically free rolling, isn't it? Yeah. Guess we try and pom the Golem. Like, getting rid of a Golem is massive. Yeah. Yeah, it's 1D. Yeah, 1D. And, it, and then Blitz through the back line on the 2D. 1D. No, 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 no. Because he's, oh, he's, yeah, he's only got three colours. He's only got three colours. One D, yeah. But the one D is he'll better than. He'll probably use both to fetch it, and then use Dauntless to get through. Rather. No, he'll put, oh, he'll put five two nays. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The two nays go on the line, and then it's a blitz. Is, he, is there any non-block guys on that? Yeah, there's the DP. Yeah, DP's so then you blitz. The... Yeah, you blitz through the DP. Yeah, you just need a three plus. You need a three plus though, don't you? Still, probably better. Is it better, or do you just dodge through? Because you four three two, aren't you? With it, it depends if you've used a re reroll and like the pick up and handoff and stuff. Mm. If you if you've used a reroll, you're better off doing the dodges. I'm pretty sure. But if you haven't the used fact, a reroll, the fact that this is still a game is completely disgusting to me. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Corn Knight's got a point. Doesn't matter if you've got block because they're both down. Stops the natty. It takes a, a square. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It yeah. Takes a square move, yeah, yeah. You still, you still need the three plus. Yeah, I mean, I said that. You, you so need then the push, but is you'd still rather, you'd still rather uh, you know, knock you the guy the quick, over if you fail, right? No, if you get the quick yeah. snap, if you get the quick snap. Nah, then... and if you get the quick snap, good. good yeah. Shot, yeah, that's a good shot, Debbie. Even then, you'd just rather, you'd rather just hurt him if, if you, if you fail, right? If you want to know. Uh, He's only failed hit. one. He failed the one that he, that he failed was against Talk 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 in the semi final. Yeah, it was. He's yeah. made every other single natty. <laughs> <laughs> Triple upheld him in overtime, didn't he? Yeah. <laughs> uh, and then picked it up in a million tackle zones because he's got big hand Aji. Yeah. Which is terrifying. All oh, right, so he's setting up for a riot as well here, I think. Hmm. Yeah. This is, who's, this is interesting. Who's getting the ball? That's fine. Yeah, he, he definitely doesn't look to be setting up to take that that uh, mighty palm on anything, does he? So. Nah, he looks like he's abandoned that. Blitz. If only you had movement 
eleven players, you could you could hit one of the nice. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you just skip, 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 skip. <laughs> Why this isn't an instant skip? Maybe he's gone outside for a cigarette and he's like, oh, fuck rats. He can't make this any better than it is, so he should just skip. No, but he can spend a lot of time in the mandatory blitz, you know, <laughs> uh, that uh, happens every single game in our eyes. Can put two wars in from the two nights, can he fuck? <laughs> no, <laughs> no. Just, they can go diagonally, so there's no way he can do anything. You, all you can do is make it worse. If he had wood elves and he could get right up to here, but I mean he can't. Can you get right can up you here. can you wizard on a blitz? I know this isn't the game, but like can, like if he had a wizard, can he bolt the? I think yes, you can. I I don't know in terms of the real rules or in Blood Bowl two because it could be different, right? It, like that's the thing, you, you know. The rules could say no, but Blood Bowl two could say yes. So, so that's the problem. Well, yes, you, get an extra time. Cool yes you can whiz on the blitz in Blood Bowl 2, but not in Blood Bowl 2020. Well, as Cool Knight says, basically Blood Bowl 2 counts the blitz as a bonus turn. So you can do all the things you would do on a turn, including use a whiz. Uh, but it's certainly in the new rules, you can't. Yeah, oh, yeah, he's got a one. Rules. Right, so now I think you dodge through. Well, he handed off the guard anyway. Oh, yeah, because the guard's got the sure feet. So, yeah. yeah, not blitzing through, yeah, not blitzing through gives you the sure feet. So, yeah, actually assisting with a guard was never really going to be the play because he wants the sure feet. So here we go then. Unless four, you get a quick snap. Four three two. Let's let's go. With no reroll. I kind of hope he makes it just to make this. What the again. hell's he doing? Oh my god. He went straight Why? through, didn't he? No, he didn't. Yeah, oh, okay. So, I thought okay. he went straight through. I was like, what the hell? No, he, he looked like he, but no, no, no. Yeah, it looked like he was going straight through. Well, there you go. One in nine. And you'd be amazed how often people do do that. Yeah, no, I literally just thought he'd click right, click hands on. <laughs> click right, click, is that the first thing I thought he did? He just did it. I literally thought it, and I was like, what the hell is he doing? So, now is uh, the real game begins. No, now is the one turn, and then it's the real game with the wizards. Yeah, do you reckon he'll just go for the one turn again? I, I think he has to. So, like, he's out fast coaching wise. I think he has to just one turn. Or well, not one turn, like maybe two turn, but like he needs to be out of range of that werewolf. Yeah, I think one turn is the option here I because the uh, yeah. werewolf yeah. you about to go can't get you whatever you want. Go. Like so. you can't even fully yeah, hit the dirty player the team, and one turn. Is by quiet. More fucking but, rats. What the and then, uh, and then like, like win it in normal time with the Jesus wizard. Christ. Here, I do feel we need to, to some degree, give in to Timmy's experience of you know. What, what mentally you're going through when you do feel massively outclassed as a code. <laughs> well, I want 500 PC, so... Oh, yeah, he failed the GFI. Oh, so he failed the first GFI, which burnt the sure feet, and then he failed another GFI. Oh, yeah, but you want them playing it was the, the challenge uh, with Daedalquist. <laughs> <laughs> I, mate, I've beaten it. Like, when there's money on the table, I'll beat anyone. Without money on the table, I'll lose to everyone. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, you beat the PC too for a uh, game with more involved. I, I quietly, I'm three zero zero against PC. Yeah. And then Dadal Chris has beaten me every time we've played, except for when it really mattered. When it was for money. <laughs> and Elliot, and Elliot has also beaten me every time we played, except when it was for money. <laughs> so maybe, oh, maybe, maybe I'm a, a shark, you know. Maybe I'm every, a every single time your uh, lovely lady dries her hair. Oh <laughs> yeah, it is really quiet though. Day. It doesn't, it doesn't wake me up anymore. Like it used to wake me up with a hair dryer. Now it's just like, it's, it's, it's well worth the four hundred dollars. <laughs> oh, it, it, it was a gift. It was a gift for yourself, not for her. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, Clever Dimmy. Clever Dimmy, you know, maximum, maximum equity. Mate, she, she deserves everything, mate. She deserves the world. I'm pretty sure that everybody agrees that she deserves better. Yeah, 100%. 100%. 100%. <laughs> <laughs>
So I I can only see a one turn here. Uh, well, maybe there's maybe there's a stall. Yeah, a stall at least a yeah two turn yeah. At least. An easy stall, like incredibly easy stall. I guess Dial want like Diamond wants to you know get him to do the stall and score in two or three and then win in normal yeah. time. But it's a risky but business still, because he's got the five, yeah. and the wizard. Yeah, yeah this is a wizard chance. And the thing is, is he will be exposing the natty on the left um, to a claw palm hit. Uh, maybe not. He might be able. To, he might be able to get enough through here. This is like re this is a threadbare defence. He should be able to screen him with. Yeah, with this is a wank wank defence. I think. Yeah. This should be chevrons, in my opinion. Yeah, I think you've got to try and stop him. But. I think yes. I think the wolf is uh, too close to the OS. You yeah. put you put you put the two golems on the outside, and then you put the three zombies on the inside, and then you protect the ghouls, and that's it. And you expose the two. Whites, I think this should be Chevron's. But he also probably thinks I don't care. Like score, I win. Yeah, yeah. There's, I think there's definitely. I mean, he didn't get close to doing anything to him on his on his previous offense, did he? That's still so, hey, the, 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 the more. The fact that this game is not over is disgusting. <laughs> Yes, you can mention it. And it's it definitely not over, over, and it definitely can be a rat win. Like, it is it is game on for problem. Don't say it's over. I mean, he killed one of the wolves, so, you know, there is some credit to that. Yeah, yeah, it's, it was a huge chance. Somebody could say that it was a sacrifice wolf, you know, because it was sent to the <laughs> mid green there. <laughs> It's weird though that he's lost that and he still seems like a big favourite, doesn't it? Like it's crazy, it's crazy how like how how well this team matches up. Skaven do have the wizard, yeah, there's just a there's just a visual bug where it, yeah, it stays uh, invisible it, it, for some reason. Because it's a wizard, you know uh... It's a, it's a it's a Russian tactic is to hide the wizard to make it look better. <laughs> PC, who is your favourite going into this half? Arsenal, probably. The Arsenal, yeah. We're 1-1 <laughs> one, one and definitely playing better than United. <laughs> if you're talking about in the Blood Bowl game that we're watching, then... I mean, I, I always think natty ability rats with a wizard uh, just have always got decent shots to win the game. Ooh, I guess as their first natty fell and they're 1-0 down, I would say probably 60-40 diamond. But I certainly don't think it's a gimme. No, it's not a gimme. It's a rat dacker this, wasn't it? I think he's put the two natties on the LOS with no chance yeah, of scoring. Yeah, I'm really confused by that, Jim. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's <laughs> as bad a decision <laughs> as not threatening the backfield at all when Diamid lurched forwards. Yeah. Well, and I do I... choose the word lurch. Yeah, it's very good. Yes, it looked like a Daka. <laughs> yeah, it is a Daka. Uh, yeah, it is a Daka. Maybe. Daka for the he's... one one and then uh, go to extra overtime with a wizard and fifty percent chance of yeah. winning it if using that. That mm -hmm. was maybe the his play, but I think the Daka is actually better now. He's got the PD. Did he not have a a little look at the semi final and how Diomed deals with Dakas, which is just thrashing into them with everything he's got? <laughs> But, uh, mm. Well, he hasn't got the diving tackle wolf, has he? No, he doesn't. That's true, yeah. It gives him a bit more of a chance. But yeah, maybe he thought like Diamond was trying to trick him into scoring quickly with the absolutely non-defense, so he thought, flip you, I'll Dakar instead. So yeah, fine. it was it was a it, it wasn't not a non-defense. It was a Dakar preparation defense. <laughs> Instead of doing that, I will put yeah, I'll put my three best players on two of my best players right on the line, where they're going to have to dodge off something. Yeah. Well, well, there's only one tackle left. Yes, true. Yeah. And uh, rats don't roll ones, right? Never. Not in my experience of playing against them. He's pulling on the Daka. What's watched. the point of the line rats on the wings? So that if he gets perfect defence, they can't move. Yeah. Genius traps. 
Yeah, protect because they the can't move the anyway because it's not. It's two bits. more three pluses. <laughs> no, from you fucking Lime idiot. filth he can't afford to lose, really. I, I, I wasn't a fan of that. But it's, yeah, they're, they're, I mean, Jimmy's right. That's the reason it's to hold those pieces in place, isn't it? Yeah, but like now I'm going straight through that flesh column on a 1D. Oh, he hasn't got Juggernaut. Oh, oh he shit. He's got, he's got Dauntless. He could go through uh... the uh, DP. He wanted. He could go through. He could just run back and just dodge people away. Yeah, I think he. I think he has to attack now, which probably suits him. And yes, it's Sadaka. It's dicey, it's isn't it? It's Skaven is so dicey. It's Sadaka. I? <laughs> I hate how dicey Skaven are. Not, like no matter how you play them, they're dicey. Like that's the problem with them for me. Like I know they're super powerful and everything. Like as powerful as the Natty is, it's just dice, isn't it? And he, he failed and like he didn't do anything wrong to be one nil down, it could have been one one just on dice, couldn't it? Yep. I he needs to score him for he needs to score him for and with yeah, like, Ploppin just rolled too many ones on the one turn. There's no way there's no way Ploppin is getting to turn eight. No, I wouldn't Without. think so. No way. No way. I don't think so, to be honest. I, I agree. Would love, I would love a scoring threat if I was popping. I'm no huge fan of the withdrawn offense, as some people may have guessed. <laughs> I think here it is particularly inappropriate. Um, as soon as they catch you, and Necro are not slow, they will get some things up there to cause hurt as soon as, you know, two turns maybe. You're going to start losing rats. Um, and then pushing forward gets harder, and then any overtime where you don't get the ball is harder. He has to and I think roll. while you've got a team scoring quickly and then trying to turn them over with the wizard, I think it's a better strategy. Mm. He has to reroll this. He has to reroll. Yeah. He, like he has to because he's getting dirty player foul. Like he literally has to reroll this. He's still he's got, got three three, three pluses three. afterwards. Yeah. But, I mean, that doesn't matter. It's this one has to work, doesn't it? This has to work. Yeah, he has to reroll this. Yeah, like you know, if your line rats fail, who cares? But you, you can't, you can't have him fail, and he, he just gets gang fell for the rest of the half, doesn't he? <laughs> and maybe he just dies, you know, because of the dodge. Yeah, which exactly. Is a classic yeah. of the one turners. Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Yeah, the one nearer there first, so he doesn't get surfed by the wolf. Yep. See, he was, he was always going to pass the three pluses, right? They were, they were the easy rolls. <laughs> yeah, leaves one rat, you know, as bait for the foul. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, perfect. Failed that one on purpose. Yeah, it's, Necro are a weird one because they're... They are hard to dacker against, but then they're hard to just play normally against, right? They've got four stand firm on the field. They've got, they've got a movement eight... Tackle Pommer, like it's it's hard to frenzy, like it's hard to play a proper offense, like a proper stalling offense against them. It's not so hard to quick score. So yeah, I, I agree you should have quick scored because it was what Diamond gave him. And then hope for the hope for the He should defense. have gone for the yeah. quicker score and then rely on the wizard and his uh, super uh, rats. Yeah, I think that was I mean that AG five with big hand is there is no ball protection. Yeah. And if you remember Dibby in the first half and how he, you know, fluttering like a schoolgirl over stalling near that one gutter on the ground, well, we could have faced seven more turns of that. Yeah. Um, with the rats having, you know, just that psychological edge of we can use the whiz and we've got the ability to sneak that ball away. Yep. Yeah. But that's why he could have used the whiz to get a, you know, a, the score there. Oh, yeah. I mean, he's yeah, gonna be—he's gonna be all right here with a dauntless blitz on the flesh column on the right. The, this, the, there needs to be a zombie on the right here. One, two, three, four. Yeah, the zombie needs to come over. He—he he can't foul this turn, ironically, yeah. because that zombie needs to cover the right flank. It's just, it's just a lino anyway, isn't it? It's just a lino, you don't foul the lino, I mean... Uh, 
Come on, have some value there. Stay mad, mate. Stay mad. <laughs> He's gonna fucking the, foul the, the line is, The thing is, He's gonna he, foul the line <laughs> If he goes for the blitz with the downless, the downless get exposed next time for the ward. Because the fleshes are uh, how many squares? One, two, three, four, five. Yes, he's gonna have to use all his movement to just hit the 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 fleshes. Yeah, he needs to cover the right. Oh, like, did you not see the game against Stick? Did you not see Ploppin's game against Stick? I when he don't... ignored the werewolf and ran <laughs> straight away to like blitz something on the right side and then got his ball carrier served. <laughs> it was it was horrendous. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, like, uh, what's his face? Uh, DMN needs to come forward here. If he fouls, he might lose. And I think he might be tempted to foul. He shouldn't foul. Alright, so now we're going through the DP. Okay, so now we're going through the right flank. Yeah, well, no, no, we're still going through the right flank. And that DP needs to make, uh, he needs to be on the anti quad. No! No, now we're blitzing through the flesh column on the right, and this is fine. Only our Juggernaut and not Dauntless. But if he powers, this is fine. Jimmy's. Jimmy's just gone AFK. Now, now we can't requires, see the fucking screen. Requires we a... It's a hundred percent. We blitz. We blitz the golem on the right. We blitz the golem on the right. We might have to put the guard right in. Hello, Zakari. Yep, he, he rolled a lot of ones. He, uh, he rolled the one on the pickup, which used his reroll. No, not on the pickup, on the handoff, which used his reroll. And then he rolled a one on the first GFI, which used his sure feet. And then he rolled a one on the second GFI, which made him fall over. Or, or we blitz through the dirty player and take the dodges. The two plus dodges, which may be better. Mm. To do what? I mean, well, we put the guard in. We put no, we put the guard in. We put the guard in between the stand firm yeah, and the play player. What do you achieve with that? You open an space there. Okay, so what do you do? You put yeah, all he needs to do is score. He's got the wizard. All he needs to do is score. With the wizard, all he needs to do is score. He might get a blitz, and it's either gamble on the stand firm on the right, or we go straight through the dirty player. I think yeah. I think go through the fleshy or don't go. Or is two of the two best options. Yeah, maybe don't go. Yeah, he's got a free hit of that fleshy as well. With uh, the dauntless, he only needs one assist. So that line rat just goes and sits in front. I wouldn't and then know we because blitz it, and then if we make it, we do it and we go. You you go through the fleshy and you make your move. All yeah. the necro team can uh, catch you. Yeah, yeah, that's the thing. You really, you, you really, can't outrun. Yeah. You, you don't achieve anything. You know, make the space move. You uh, got there. He can't. Then... He can't dack her again. He can't dack her again. I, I don't like going back. I, I like like holding yeah. this line here with line rats. Yeah, he's so that you've this. got you've got space behind. Whereas going back in, you know, it it just it depends. I mean, that you know, Diamond's gonna come for you, which might leave a gap, right? So, nah, he's fucked this. It, this was the turn. I, 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 I'm okay with not going this turn. I like this turn. Uh, and you should be blitzing with the Dauntless as well. If you're going to do the Flesh Column, you blitz with the Dauntless. If you're going to do the Dirty Player, it doesn't matter who you blitz with. Probably the Wrestle. <laughs> but you need to... Well, actually, okay. <clears throat> I I prefer my my favorite thing was not going either way and, and holding that higher line. I I don't uh, see you know the point of okay you know uh, take down the fleshy or the dirty player then move some grass there and then what? Next well, he's gonna up. mate. Next turn is gonna be horrendous, mate. <laughs> next mm -hmm. turn. But it was going to be horrendous anyway. No, this mm. next turn is gonna be worse than this first this turn here. I mean, this is okay because he's five away, right? So. Mm -hmm. this, this does buy him another turn by going back but I, I kind of would have rather 
had these guys engaged, but then you've got more freedom to like go somewhere interesting next turn. Whereas now you're just left with another horrible turn, and then you've got no space behind you for the next turn. The deck is sure is interesting, though, isn't it? It's great that like no one has that much experience of it. Some of us would say we have too much experience of it. <laughs> yeah, but you know, PC, I mean, how many thousands of games have you played and KFOG and I've played, you know, thousands and thousands and thousands of games. And then how many games have we all played with a DACA? Not that many, right? Like, there's not that many people with probably a hundred yes. games with a DACA. Yeah, no, that's fair. So. And against, it's, it's a bit like vampires and Kislev, isn't it? You know, when people, or Slan, when people play against them, they just haven't played against vampires that much. Most people, like, you know, just haven't played against vampires that much and haven't played against Kislev that much and stuff. So, like, they're a lot worse. Yeah, they just don't know what, what they're capable of. Yeah. So it, it's, 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 it's... top at the moment where, of course, Kislev and Slan aren't in the rules at all. <laughs> yes. um, and hence the NAF have sort of not changed them, so whereas most other teams have got more expensive and things. NAF have just said, no, we're just going to make Slan as they were. And yet, of course, tournament organisers are still tearing them as if they're terrible. And so people are facing something that's slightly undercosted, that they've never faced before, and that they've no idea how to deal with. And the gay folk is playing. <laughs> yes, well, that, that might be why gay folk's playing them. <laughs> I'm not saying he's a filthy min max that will do anything for the smallest advantage, but he does tend to win a lot. What, <laughs> even still 10k TV? <laughs> yes, to me. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, PC, yeah. love you. Yeah. Still got 3 zero, 0 with a team that was uh, gimped to get rid of that, though, hey? There you go. There you go. Coached. <laughs> Coached nine zero zero that weekend, including the three sevens. I, I won the UFC championship, but I was off my nuts on steroids. So. <laughs> <laughs> Not really the same, is it? but yeah, it's it's funny to <laughs> it's funny to say the odd thing, isn't it? The odd. Oh, what is that wolf doing? He's got to no. be a safety, hasn't he? He's got to be yeah, a safety. Has to be. It's only it's, this is only this is there. nah. He has to go all in or not all in. I think. No, the Agility 5 can just laugh at anything coming forwards towards them and, and potato through, so he has to have something back to deal with that. But, like, he can't cover, like, because now he just blitzes through the guard zombie. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, he just blitzes through the guard zombie, he's got a sideline cage. I thought the, uh... Oh what? Okay, Ooh. this oh. is not a defense. <laughs> oh no! Now this is now this okay. Is now you definitely now defense. you definitely go through because if you power him as well, like here is a great place to have his next. You're not forced on the sideline. Like uh, who was it? Who was it? Went took the sideline. It was Nolly, wasn't it? When Nolly like Nolly had like a breakthrough, didn't he over here against Diomed? Uh, in, if you remember the match, and I wanted to like him to break through like here. And you know maybe he's leave a, leave a hit on the ball, but like at least you've got a bit of space, right? But he, he went sideline. Yeah, if you go sideline, yeah, you're yeah. absolutely fucked. You can't go sideline. He got absolutely which is, yeah, yeah, which is why I didn't space. like going. I, I I would have gone if I had to go. I would have gone right rather than left last turn, but I preferred not going. Whereas now, yeah, you get to take this space, which is so much better. Like having a bit bit of space. Yeah, so this I mean this is obvious. You've got wrestler hit him as well. So. It's fucking terrible from uh, DMed. A little bit, yeah, a little bit. He's got a blitz in with Wrestle though. Yeah, yeah, you've got to because you just want him down. Oh no, he's not. Uh, well, he's got a he's gonna wall. dauntless. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just oh just my god, you. Yeah. Yeah, Absolute. Yeah. Ploppen. And now it has to be re rolled. <laughs> oh my god, Ploppen, you twat. That was a free two dice. <laughs> yeah, with Wrestle. Been, oh my god. Been, I guarantee two dies without the downless. That's probably yeah. the worst turn I've risk. ever seen. That's probably the worst turn I've ever seen in Jealous. <laughs> yeah, not, not doing that with Wrestle feels a little harsh, but I I mean, in Ploppin's defense, had that Dauntless word, had he got the power, then not only would that Blitzer have been free to move forwards and start to defend a cage, but every other rat would, and there's only one rat left behind, which means there's you know, loads and loads of rats defending the ball. 
At least make it like a two dice without Dauntless, though. Yeah. Yeah, like, put, this like, guy could have come all the way yeah. around, right? And it's yeah, like, it's, it's still and still been part of the defence exactly. the next turn. Right Literally right. nearly where, where he's gone anyway, right? He could have just yeah. done one yeah. more square. Uh, <laughs> yeah. this, is, this is horrendous. This is the worst turn in Chalice. Yeah, it, 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 it wasn't good, was it? And it's oh, in a wow. final. Well, I mean, come on, you. Yeah, yeah that's, a bit, that's a bit excessive, didn't <laughs> Oh, Okay, okay. All right. Maybe not. It's the worst, <laughs> okay, it's the worst turn I've ever seen in a Chalice final. Is, I saw some of Sparky's turns, you know. Yeah. Okay, maybe yeah. maybe some of the worst turn I've ever seen in the Chalice final. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that no? We've seen we've seen Sparky, we've seen we've What's seen Woohoo doing? Boy. Woohoo Boy won it. We've seen Magikarp versus Paige, haven't we? We've seen some. I thought Magikarp played alright, to be fair. Oh, there you go. <laughs> there wasn't any turns like this. I mean that was it was greedy it, it, it was just greedy right he just thought that, you know he, there was a lot of payoff there's a lot of like if you if you use two players and 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 have mighty blow then there's more payoff than using three players and and not having mighty blow he's giving so, like, up he's like, he's like oh, I need to get a man in in range and now that rat is getting claw pumped oh my god this turn could have been so much better oh my god I'm <laughs> Tilted. I'm tilted. <laughs> that AG5 is going to come through, and he that AG5 is going to dodge through behind the shrimp or goal, and he's going to tag. He's going to tag the wolf with his AG5. Oh my god, he's going to do it. No. The AG5. The AG5 has moved him. Do you mean the other natty? Oh yeah, that one. That one. That one is going to come through and tag the wolf. I 100% yeah, guarantee it. Yeah, I 100% guarantee it. Yeah, which is horrendous as well. Yeah, just one dodge and a GFI. No, he's not gonna. He's gonna tag the wolf. He has to tag the wolf. I think he should have done. Yeah, right. I guess he can just make two GFIs. Then he's got. Then he's got two scoring threats. Uh -huh. It doesn't even make the GFIs. What the fuck is going on? I guess the good thing is if he if he blitzes him, then this guy's free, right? So like, he can't and then he can't cover both. So yeah, that's not that's not bad. Actually. Is it not? I don't know. Oh, you might be able to come around the back here because he can if he knocks him in one two. This three, turn four, was seven. so great. Like I think Diomed's last turn was poor, and I think this turn was extremely poor. Yeah, he can. He's got. He got two D on the ball, hasn't he? From Freshy, Freshy can two D the ball. So do do you two D the ball is the question, I guess. Well, yeah, he just comes around the back and chains him onto the ball. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So it's super easy hit on the ball. I guess you, I guess you go for it because then you're jamming One, him the two, sideline. One, three, with, four, with, uh, five, six. Firm anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just chain him onto the ball. Yeah, easy. It's super easy to get there. Defending the right. ball is super. And easy. you can, uh, you get a power, good news. If not, you get a push. The ball is uh, at the sideline. Yeah. Yeah, this is interesting, isn't it? This is, I mean, this is this is an interesting turn because he could he could get a count he could get a counter score here, couldn't he? Like if he if the ball goes in the crowd. He's got that wolf. He's got uh, he's got this ghoul. So like, yeah, yeah, the guards in. I'm I'm sure he's gonna go for this. But yeah, I'm sure he's gonna go for it. You reckon he hits the rat first or just walks around? Uh, I think he's got to hit it, hasn't he? One, two. He needs three, to cancel. Four, he needs to cancel. Double the GFI. Effect. Double GFI. Otherwise, so he probably he probably wants to power this rat first. This is this is. I can't believe Diomed's got away with this, honestly. I love mm -hmm. Diomed, and like, honestly, he got away with an horrendous turn. Well, you love him, but you are not going to talk to him ever again. <laughs> Never again. I don't think I am after this. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think I am. That was an absolutely horrendous turn, the turn before this. That's it's weird, because you, you, you want a guard in here, right? Or... Yeah, probably a guard. Yes, the blitz. In there. Yes, the blitz. I guess he can yeah. put in there. Uh, the in. white has to come around the back. I mean, the the white the white blitzes. No, no, no. The white comes around the back, and then the flesh golem blitzes. Oh yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. There was a zombie can go around the back then. Am I insane for thinking there's a four plus two plus two plus? White blitz on the ball that I might be tempted by. No, as I chain, say, completely chain, out of position. Chain him, chain, chain him, the golem, chain the golem, chain the golem, chain the golem, chain the golem Yeah, but that's, then, that's then, then it is. If, you, if you're going to hit the ball, that's that's the way to do it. 
Oh, I don't like moving this guy first though, because now your reaction is. I think you need the you need the Axe three to react. So I would I would have not moved any of these three mobile players here. I would not moved any of these three, and and I would have done this hit and this blitz. He's not going for it. Oh, he's not it's going for it. <gasps> he's not going for it. Wow. I think it was worth going for. It. Only only gets a push. Oh. Only gets a push. Wow. And he's in range. Oh my god. Wow. Rerolls. Oh, okay, it has to reroll. That's a burn of a reroll, though. Oh, well, that's oh, a right. cast, though. Oh, Great reroll. Oh, that's fine. <laughs> but you see now, because he's gone that way, this guy's free, isn't he? Yeah, it's just two pluses all the way through to hand off, and the wolf. Oh, okay, the wolf is still in range. Why didn't he tag the wolf? Why wasn't this guy in range? Like, he just had to do two GFIs last turn. Yeah, to I think he had horrendous. to. Do that. It was horrendous, yeah. Really weird, I mean, wasn't it? This looked like he was setting up. He put in the guard there so that he, you know, he, he didn't have to use the flesh eater blitz if he didn't want to, and he would assisted here to like. It really looked like he was setting up for that. The ball hit. I mean, they're back to back the most horrendous turns ever. <laughs> it's a bit excessive. You're gonna have to say. I think if you're gonna do a withdrawn offense, and there's tactically times that you should, then don't do them this badly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Now you've lost the impetus, you've lost the wizard, you've lost your overtime edge. I mean, he hasn't lost the wizard, he's still got the wizard. Uh, it's just the well, invisible wish. Yeah, invisible. he's got it, it's just invisible, but he has Oh, got it's it. invisible, okay. So what, but, what he can do with like, it the, the problem is, is this werewolf. Yeah, the problem is the werewolf. Oh, no. Yeah, so now this it's... Guy, I think this guy's in range, right? If this guy's in range, you just hand off to him and score. He's not in range. But he wasn't in range, yeah. I think he should have been. Yeah, but now you dodge off and tag the wolf. So you, you, you 1D blitz the dirty player, run the natty up the right, and then you dodge off the other natty and tag the wolf, and then pray for a 1 in 9. Yeah. Uh, it's horrendous. Gotta save that whiz, yeah. Save the whiz for open ladder. That's the that's the that's the best one. <laughs> I'm really sad because, like, Diamond literally gave Ploppen a win, and then Ploppen just tried to one deer got him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I think I think you one deer here, and if you get the pow, you tag the other zombie. You, you can try to uh, you can try to tag the wolf right with this with this uh, line on a one in nine, but you only got one reroll left. So that's a bit terrible. So maybe what you do is you you one day blitz him, and maybe you don't even one day blitz him. Maybe you just dodge him away, run down the field, and then he just tags the wolf and then passes to him. Ah, uh, that's not bad. Or you just double oh, one. Yeah, no, that's it. That's. Are you just instantly double one? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, probably deserved, to be fair. Yeah. I mean, I, I hate to say it, but I, I do feel this half was ill conceived and poorly executed. Yeah, probably deserved. Yeah. And when you've got the Ooh. whiz in your pocket, to look like the game might end without it having any impact is pretty shocking. Like, yeah, I, I have to agree with PC. I feel like DMS. I'm really disappointed with DMS. Um, not this turn, the turn before. Wait, now do chain the. And now he just wins. He just wins for free. Like, it's... Yeah, right. no, he has. Yeah, he's got to hit the ball without a tackle or all wrestle. No, no, yeah, it's not. Wrestle. It's not done yet. And there is still the whiz to try and recover it, but. Yeah. Hmm. He needs, uh, he needs a power here. If he powers here, he could put in two guards and then 3D with Wrestle, which is about the best hit you're going to get, isn't it? Okay, lads, here we go. Well, the number of ones is ridiculous. I don't think he even needed ones, mate. Like, genuinely, the turn where he decided to 1D the flesh golem was the turn he decided he wanted to lose the game. <laughs> Yeah, that was. But it, no, you know. To be fair, to be fair, Demi, like he was in a real pickle, right? And then maybe he if wasn't. He, like he, he can was. Two he was. That with I know. I know he was. I know he can two D wrestle. But the thing is, there's more payoff 
to, to wandering it, right? There is more payoff to wandering it. So he obviously assessed the his assessment of the equity was if he puts in three players to hit with wrestle, the payoff it like you know the, the position isn't going to be strong enough. So he put in. He just did for the one, and you know. I... Yeah, the, yeah, the snake is harsh, right? The snake is harsh. But then, like you say, like the guy wasn't even in scoring range anyway. So yeah, like, I'm not saying I liked it, but I think you're just being a little bit too, too savage. Sorry, I apologise. I apologise. I, I, yeah, I apologise. Yeah, so yeah, he's, obviously, just... he's obviously done better than I would ever do in a chalice anyway. So like, hats off to Poppin. Doesn't get him. Wow. Now this is interesting. Oh, it's not because that will go on a stand. Yeah, and he can just he can block it off, so he can't even get forward. Oh, he doesn't block it off. He could have gone forward to here, right? He could have just fully blocked it off. But then I guess then he's, this guy could have got away, and then you can only one D him. Well, some might remember a little skink running all the way down the sideline through the a Andy Davo defence. Bolt the werewolf and sprint down the sideline is what yeah. we do here. Yeah, I don't hate what Dibby's saying that. Aye. We've and seen a skink do that, that against niggled, Dalo, as I was That saying. is a niggled AV bust werewolf. You bolt the werewolf and you sprint down on a million two pluses. Yep, yep. Or you are out of chalice. <laughs> do it, Diamed. Do it. Fucking bolt the werewolf, please. Plopping, plopping, plopping. Plopping, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm plopping. Bolt the werewolf. Hey, this bolt one, this the one's werewolf. three, isn't it? Three, two... Three, two, two, two. Well, he can he can one D wrestle four, the five, uh... six. He can also bolt the wrestle zombie, which is less of a dodge through, and then the player that's tagging on two go for its can tag the wolf. Yeah, but it's an it's a yeah, eight out of nine dodge away though, isn't it? Tag, tagging yeah, the wolf isn't bolt, good enough. Bolt if you zap the, the zombie first, Jim. Bolt the werewolf. Yeah, but tagging the wolf isn't good enough. Because he just oh, dodges okay. eight out of nine, doesn't he? he? Like, yeah. he Bolt does. the werewolf, please, Ploppin. Bolt yeah. the werewolf. Bolt him, Dude, then stomp right. him in the nuts. That's 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 what. You, if you don't break AV, then you do the dodge off and stomp him. And then if you and then if you win the overtime toss, you win anyway. Just bolt the werewolf, Ploppin. Come <laughs> on, man. Yeah, I think you have to. I think you literally have to. Do it now. I think you literally have to because what else are you gonna do? I don't think he's going to do it either. I really don't think he's going to do it. Please bolt the werewolf. Pop him. Please bolt the werewolf. <laughs> yeah, he's got to be thinking about it. He's going to run out of time. I think he has to. I think I agree. I think he just has to. There's no, there's no other option, mate. Bolt the werewolf, armor break. And then just 3 plus, 2 plus, 3 plus. Two plus three, or two plus, and and then and then there's no one who's going to stop him scoring apart from the wrestle zombie, and you got a rat. Oh, oh he hasn't he's done it. I could do it end of turn, no. but not if he turns over. That's the problem, right? No. Yeah, I think you have. That that settles it. No wizard this time. Yeah. Oh. Well, he could he could end of turn bolt, but he has to he has to not turn over to be able to do that because blood bolt two is shit. <laughs> yeah. End of turn bolt, come on. Why are you why are you in a place that you can get blitzed by not the werewolf? <laughs> I think it's so that the other gutter can get involved if he does lose it. Because I don't think he plans to bolt. Why doesn't he go over this side? You've you've there's a there's a there's a white right here. I know, this is what I'm saying. It's just, just Oh, I kinda want Ploppen to win, like, which is crazy because I I don't want him to win like I am so confused bowl the werewolf and run down the sideline he's gonna throw it away <laughs> my god that's not the play boys not, that's not the answer now he comes the fucking <laughs> G5 and it's GG <laughs> I mean, if this wolf had been stunned, that would have been pretty good, wouldn't it? <laughs> but he's not. <laughs> I think maybe it's a subtle plan. He's planning on the wolf picking up the ball and then bolting it. 
Oh, yes! Yes. Give him hope to crash it. <laughs> He's yes. trying to keep the wolf off hitting the AG5. Now, I think Diamond's smarter than that. I think he'll hit the AG5 and then go back and pick up the ball. I don't okay. think he'll pile onto it. Maybe don't I even know. pick it up, right? Just because you can foul this guy, you can fail the pickup. So depending on if you get the if you get the AV break, just stand next to it and then get another assistant to foul. This move seven can nearly get there. Um, and then foul him with an assist. And you could take out both gutters because you want it up, right? You don't need to score. Bolt the werewolf. Yeah, I really like bolting the werewolf. Yeah, well, yeah, wolf the edge five and then foul the natty and then you're safe, basically. Oh, the goddamn werewolf. One turn in overtime. You would have been able to stall it if you got the armor break as well. Yeah, yeah, exactly, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Like, go over here, like, bolt and see what happens, and then and then do the rest of your Mighty thing. blow on, like, AV7. Hey, he just rolled some dice, Academical. Yeah, sorry, the dads are shit, aren't they? I can't control them now. But yeah, he just, he just ran through. Ran, he didn't stay on the sideline, though, which is so why he brought this... He brought this... Uh, Brought this white into the play, which was bizarre, if you ask me. <laughs> if he doesn't pom that at you five, then I will definitely never speak to Diamond again. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like making these rando blocks when not only have you only got like one reroll left for the match, you've only got yes, one reroll left for the turn. A... You have to do this blitz first. This is yeah. this is the whole do game. Do the big here. play first. Yeah, he needs to pom that at you five. Well, he needs to hit the AG5, and then he needs to foul the the other natty. Yeah, he can't pom it. He can't pom it, I don't think. Because he has to have it down, and not like, you know, he has to have it... He has to have him, his wolf up, I think. He could have had the... Oh, no, he couldn't, because he had the foul. He could, have, he could have blocked this guy, and then had the wolf back, uh, the white back to make it 3D, you know? Yeah. Oh my god. So now that he's up, he can't score, can he? He can't score. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. He can't score this turn. So you don't have to pick it up, you can just stand in front of it. Yeah, that's not good enough, Jim. Yeah, it is. It's totally fine to stand in front. Just stand in front of it. Then you can't fail the GFI and you can't fail the pick up. And you get the foul of the Natty. Yeah, it's a couple of 2 2 pluses that you. It's 2 2 pluses. And then you bowl. Then you bowl the werewolf. You bowl yeah, him whether he's got the ball or not, Dimmy. <laughs> Having the ball doesn't stop, like doesn't affect him getting bolted, does it? Because he loses it when he gets bolted. It's bodger versus no bludge. Yeah, but he gets bolted anyway, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, he's getting bolted. Like, if he doesn't bolt him now, then I don't know why I'm watching this game. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I'm saying, he's getting bolted regardless of whether he's got the ball or not. So so going for the ball pickup is just a 2 plus and a 3 plus. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fuck, the ball. yeah. fuck the ball. Fuck the ball. Just ball the wall. Now the question is whether do you dodge this guy for the extra assist, and he does. Uh, and then you've got to foul. Yeah. Got to foul also ball. means without... Yeah, it just puts another AG3 in the area, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, I like... I like Which is a nice thing to do. Gets, gets the, the foul, break. gets the removal. So it's a bolt, and then it's just whether or not he rolls fucking pals on four dice. Yeah, and if you get the armor break. Hey, he's gonna get the armor break. It's niggled and AV bust. <laughs> if only you would automatically armor break armor seven. Games versus rats and and no. Well, it's, armor, it's armor six. It's armor six. Dibby, as someone who armor. quite often uses dwarfs to hit snotlings, let me tell you, there is no such thing as a guaranteed <laughs> armor break. <laughs> it's guaranteed. Mighty blow against AV five. It just there's so many times it doesn't happen. You could just roll the one on the bolt. Yeah, he's got a bolt now. He has to because you lose if you don't. You have to. Please. If you roll one, you just dodge through the wolf and still pick the ball up. Your AG5. Ploppen, please. Yeah. Just bolt the werewolf. Ploppen, yeah, please. Forgot he's got it. No, he's... Bolt the werewolf. He hasn't bolted him. Oh my Jesus. god. <laughs> what is he doing? <laughs> he's used dodge already. 
<laughs> now he we'll bolts the werewolf. Anyway. Now he bolts the werewolf. He's I mean, he's... Um... Oh. You've got oh, a GFI, oh, oh. so you can't bolt you. He can't, with, he he can't, can't. blitz you too. So you have to make the GFI. Yeah, there you yeah, go. have to get off him just in case the bolt fails. And you still have to bolt him. <laughs> And you he's should have gonna, bolted him before. He's just not going to get powered on four dice, he knows it. He doesn't know he's got a wizard, does he? Oh yeah, maybe it's disappeared for him too. Maybe he does. <laughs> <laughs> what, is, what is going on? Ladies and gentlemen, I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh, the werewolf man. <laughs> the get used and we all just didn't realise it. No, I'm sure it hasn't. Because it, this it is, it's gone. It definitely hasn't. There's no, there's no mark on the pitch. He definitely had one. No, yes, yes. He actually used the wizard. Well, the, I mean, this is dereliction of duty. Yeah. Cause... You can derelict my balls, Hans. <laughs> you know what? You know what's going to be hilarious is if he, if he stuns the ball carrier, and then dodges out with a goal and fails the dodge into a stun. And then it's a perfect stall, anyway. Yeah, yeah. You got to dodge one D here, haven't you? Because you got to, you got to nail this goal. Bolt the werewolf, please, Ploppen. We bolt. are the bolt wolf. <laughs> oh, bolt the werewolf. He's not going to. He's not going to bolt the werewolf. Bolt the werewolf. He's blitzed already, has he? Or did he blitz? Oh, did he blitz this? Oh, pointless blitz. Oh my god. I can't watch this, honestly. I, I just. <laughs> I can't oh, watch come this. Come on, Dimmy. It's not that there. Uh... It's killing my nerves. It's killing my nerves. Like, I don't even but... want the rights to win. I want I want Diomed to win, but like. Diomed's giving him chances to win. Yeah, like, that's obviously his assessment is is if he keeps the bolt for later, then it gives him more chance to win, and, like, he's just got to hope he gets the look now, and it's giving him more win percentages overall. I can understand it, but it's, it's fucking it's wrong. Lot, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, I think you've got to get to overtime first, and you're not going to get to overtime, so... And if he gets to overtime without a whiz, he's got a 50% chance of the ball and a chance to one-turn it, so... Exactly, yeah. It's just, it's just wrong. Yeah. yeah, and he can't bolt the wolf while it's on the floor, because it's pumped. What, what? Yeah, there we go. That's game one. Surely. Oh my god, Ploppen. More or less. More or less. Oh, the white knight. He hasn't got anyone that can tag this, uh... Skaven. It's jump four, you just blit... Uh, yeah, you, you want to tag him after you blitz him. You want to tag him after... You want him tagged after you blitz him, though, right? Just foul him. Do you foul him? The blitz was the wolf. Oh yeah, the wolf was there. Yeah, yeah, so you can't blitz, yeah. So just just knock him over. You don't need punch, to yeah, pick the ball up. You just need to stop yeah, him. Uh, that's GG. Good yeah, night. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, oh, ploppin'. Well, theoretically that rat can recover and score in time, but... I don't think it was a rowdy piling at all, Kalon, because he just he just gets bolted, right? He finally gets bolted, right, if he doesn't pile on there. Yeah, that is 100% a pylon. Yeah, that was a... Uh, Unless was you cas be... him or KO him on the first yeah. hit. <laughs> yeah, 100% the wolf, the wolf was going to end in the ground, one way or the other. Oh. Basically, yeah, Poppin's right. refusal to use the wizard is his downfall. Yeah. Well, I mean, I'd get back to the withdrawn offence decision in the second half, which I didn't like. Um, and not just that I might be withdrawn offence, I thought tactically it was the wrong choice. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it was fine until he 1D'd the flesh golem. <laughs> no, for no reason. He had like, more chances fine. going for the one turner. I was really upset with Diamed for giving him the free hit on the flesh golem with Wrestle. The like, Lord is right, the Wiz can fail, but do you know what definitely doesn't work? It's not using it at all. Yeah. yeah. That's, that's, that's less odds of it being successful. Yes, yes. I'm really disappointed. Like, yes. it was so close to a good final. Blockless bolts can fail, but, you know, if you don't use it at all, you fail it 100% of the time. Yeah. Oh. You miss 100% of the shots you don't take. Yes, I think the play was, uh, for the second half, was quick score and then defend with uh, having the IG5 and the 2 and a wizard. That was. 
a horrible situation for the Negro. It was, yeah. it was literally yeah. fine until he did the one D with the Dauntless on the flesh column. Yeah, I mean, it was it was always going to be hard, but like you know, it kind of gives you more win chances. Like it arguably gives you more win chances. Dackering, like I, I'm I'm not a hundred percent against the Dacker, but like yeah, I think once you've done. I mean, that, mate, like honestly, I think the right coach won, but like the right coach definitely gave him a lot more opportunity to win this than he should have had. Mm. Is my hot take, and I'm sorry for being toxic and <laughs> yeah, He either forgot it or, I mean, because with four of us, they can't. I mean, I know I've, my attention has occasionally been elsewhere, but there's no way that wizard got used to being so fucking you obsessed with rats that somehow. you're about yeah. to go on holiday and you, and like, you, or, go, you qualify. There's a bug, team, meaning he doesn't get access to it, in which case it has to be a replay fine. Oh, oh yeah. That oh, maybe that's his play. Maybe that's his play. He's going to say it was bugged and he couldn't use the wizard. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no. my god, what what a magnificent uh, way. <laughs> you just need to do it, you know, in every single challenge game. <laughs> I can use the wizard. The ones you lose, you know, uh, I, I lost yeah, because I couldn't use the wizard. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that best, sounds like every best final rebel. since Dimmy won Chalice. <laughs> that, that, that sounds like every rebel. <laughs> It does, yeah. Oh my god, yeah, that yeah. that mysterious wolf bark, wasn't it? The mysterious yeah, bug that's never yeah. happened ever. Apart from this one won. time. Apart yeah, from this one that, time when Wolfbark was winning. Funny that. Yeah, that was horrendous. It was out of out of like I can't believe he just like he just Carried sucked up it up. Rebel. Yeah, yeah, like fuck off. But like fuck them instantly. Oh yeah, there's the lightning bolt look and it it, it uh it KO'd him. Imagine if he'd done that well, like three turns ago. I mean just Oh. Just oh. Yeah, that's. I mean, the right coach won. The right coach won. Yeah. Like honestly, I think like no disrespect to Ploppen, but Ploppen and Bash obviously maybe you know under a lot of pressure. Yeah, mate. Imagine that. being in the final with Chalice. Like, I, yes, I. I know Chalice nerves are a meme, but I do wonder if he did forget for a couple of turns that, um, you know, the wizard was an option for him. I don't it was think so screaming. I think they're an actual uh, reality, you know, you, are, uh, you have invested a lot of hours, a lot of things, and all come to this. Yeah, yeah, like that's the thing, okay, yes, it's a stupid little kids game, but still, yeah, as you say, you've put a lot of hours into it. You and have it is... invested a lot of time, a lot of things, there's going to be a lot of people watching, people are going to come, this is the, the game, everybody's going to be talking about, at least for, you know, a few days. Or something like that. This is your chance to win Chalice if you haven't ever won before, or whatever it is. So you know, it's end of the day. You are playing in a competition. Yeah. You want to win it. You know, it's like, oh, it would be so nice if I win it. And then you're in the situation, like, oof, oof. And the Omed has been, uh, I think, the Omed uh, got the mental game. You know, he throw him out of his uh, every single plan that the uh, Ploppen had. The Omed uh, had a counter that was very aggressive, so it's like, okay, I plan to do this and this, and suddenly you find in a situation that you don't expect. I mean, nobody would expect that the uh, Dio was going to be, you know, so aggressive at the beginning of the game. Yes. You know, yeah. you know I, and after that happens, all your game plan is coming down in pieces. It's like, what I do now, you know, because this is not what's supposed to go. Mm. So that has a point, you know. Oh, the uh, werewolf, man. Just bolt the, the werewolf, goddamn both werewolf. The play, yes. <laughs> yes, it was the, the werewolf, but you know, I'm uh, saying, you know, that we always see stupid kids' game. I always say that makes me. Because it's a game, but it's not stupid because you have invested a lot of time in it. You have your fun having it. You have made friends playing it, you know, something like that. And this comes, you know, the biggest game you're going to play on Blood Bowl 2. Probably. Yeah. Yeah, it's fair. So, you know, uh, and Jesus, how many hours, how many teams to qualify, how many things like that. So when people make mistakes in finals and all that, it's perfectly normal. And every single person that they have been able to reach their fair final will tell you that, yes, they were nervous. Yeah. Nobody's like, ah, I don't care, blah, blah. No, because if you don't care, blah, blah, you have to lead the team. And don't Rick, keep going with it. Rick doesn't get nervous. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I've got to say, Fermi, I didn't get nervous before the final I played. But, but the th that's because I was at a massive disadvantage and thought it was pretty much but, zero but, chance but, anyway. But. There is an but, element of as well, right? Poppin might think this is the only chance he's going to get as well, right? This yeah. is the only time he's going to get to the final. Yeah. Yes, like, you know, as, as you tell me, PC, that the first time, the first time you play the final in a long tournament, yeah, 
I was four hundred. Four hundred old. Oh no, the first time ever in my life on Fumble. Yes, I was perhaps a bit nervous. Yeah. yeah exactly. You know, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, no, that's fair. Any more finals or something like that? I'm talking. You know, I think he hasn't. Yeah, yeah, exactly. They know more final. So this is the first, you know, the big one and yep. like that. Yeah. After later, when you play more big games, something like that, okay, you get used to it, you know. I don't expect PTK, you know, coming and telling, saying, you know, oh, I got nervous, something like that. Jesus Christ, no. That's <laughs> feeling. PTK doesn't have those, yeah. you know. But even uh, Jimmy, when was playing the, his final on uh, Chalice, you could see there were, you know, moments of doubt, overthinking, yeah. and things like that, because it's a normal thing. Even someone as mentally strong as Jimmy. Yeah. <laughs> you know, as so as a rock. Yeah. Um, you, exactly. you, you've, got, you've got a good point, and we do joke about it, but there, of course there's nerves. You know, you, you know a couple of hundred people wolf. might be watching or, or um, And, you know, as you said, it might be your one shot to do something in the game. Exactly. Like, that you really uh, care about. That's, that's fair enough. It's been 48 seasons of the cup and all that, and uh, whatever it is, you know. There is, well, I was, I was going to say there are not that many left, but could be another 48 <laughs> <laughs> before. But, you know, when you're playing... You think they're stopping game, it before Blood Bowl 3, then? Yes, you, 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 you know, you, you're thinking, you know, maybe this is the only time, because it's not easy yeah. to reach the final of the Chalice. No, it isn't. No, nope. really isn't. very fair. And you know, not everyone's like like streamers playing you know hundreds of games a season, right? So yeah, this this could definitely be the only chance he's going to get. And yeah, I can't blame people at all because yeah. like, it's just it didn't, and it, you know like people like footballers getting paid three hundred grand a week get nervous and stuff, don't they? So how can you expect people who are like just playing for fun not to and stuff? So yeah, I think it's I think Chalice yeah. nerves as much as they've been turned into a meme are are completely completely. Yes. Of course, they're yeah, I mean, the werewolf, mate. Bolt the werewolf. <laughs> That's it, that's it, you know, but yeah, yeah, that's the that thing I can see that the stadium Twitch plop and also stream, so if you was streaming this game, imagine the extra stress of like, streaming your game, your final, and you are playing, you know, like, okay, this, this game, you know, it's gonna be the one I wanna be, I'll be remembered. Oh, shit, yeah, I've seen the Arsenal school. Yeah, let's not talk about that, but it does mean I might play some Blood Bowl tonight as I'm not watching much of them. <laughs> we dominated the game, but they have come away with the win, so there we are. These they all, we obviously didn't bolt the werewolf, did we? Yeah, no, we, didn't. we absolutely didn't. <laughs> absolutely comedy mega dice. And on that bombshell, thanks thanks very much. Finally, uh, Dimmy and PC, all of you are absolutely glorious as always. Thank you so much, guys. What a dream team of commentary. Oh, yes. It's always a pleasure to be here. I wish Kaidon was here. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So <laughs> yes, I mean, not at the expense of anybody else, but yes, it was. You know, Kaylon's great, isn't he? And he's been been doing a lot of the cast. So yeah, it was great. And thanks for that, Dimmy. And thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic. <laughs>